Hello, good, good evening, viewers at home. Uh, my name is Adil Tiolatunle Michael. I am seeing you are seeing me to this evening, uh, just to tell you and to uh, actually prepare your mind, uh, in order to be able to decode some of the coded uh, information in my it's not being a very easy task and many people still find it very very uh, difficult to actually put so many things on there just because some people thought biology is too wide uh, i want to really assure you that uh, in this uh, omega biodetainment they have been able to decode uh, some of the coded information so as to be able uh, some of the very difficult and most difficult subject in biological sciences uh, it doesn't actually matter which of the biological sciences uh, area that you actually belong cell biology is it cell biology microbiology environmental biology physiology or whether you are uh, a, physio a physiologist ecologist evolutionist genetist which area of biology you you really uh, belong to uh, there are some things that you need to take home in uh, this my special edition of uh, uh, knowing and decoding decoded uh, topic topics in biology sciences so what i'm going to start doing is to be able to give you some of the shortcuts ways to understanding some of these uh, difficult seem difficult biological uh, topics so that uh, by the time you get into the exam or you are preparing for exam or once you are able to remember or, or any of this uh, short form or short formula you'll be able to actually see uh you'll be able to actually make use of this as very very important so that you'll be able to learn them very fast today we have actually come on uh, a very good ground and that is uh, going back to decoding decoded so i want to talk about coding decoding uh decoding decoded coded codes in molecular biology so in molecular biology so and don't forget that no matter what in molecular biology the first thing you must get uh, acquainted with is that the a lot of code to start from dna right from uh, uh, down to rna then uh, amino acid and all this one many people find it very difficult to be able to understand so many things about dna uh, and that's the reason why you just cast your mind back let's start from our cell biology so this is let's assume this is sir uh, so this is the nucleus here you should know that this is where they call the cytoplasm okay cyto means cell and when uh, uh, plasm means liquid so that means you are talking about the liquid component of the cell which we can term we can actually regard as the blood of the cell is called the cytoplasm now the second part of it is called the nucleoplasm nucleoplasm and just like you know nucleo actually come from nucleus that is the liquid content of the nucleus is called the uh, nucleoplasm and that is where we have the information of all, all of this so once you are able to know the location so don't forget that uh, and that's the reason why we actually talk about uh, dna as being very very vital for assistance so because dna is the is the site 
Huh? We are information about the organism actually reside. So if you are going to do anything with the cell, once you are able to manipulate successfully the DNA, you should be able to know that uh, already you have been able to have access to that information. So your access to the DNA is an access to the information regarding or concerning the whole organism. So once that one is now established, you should know that uh, when we are talking of DNA, we are already talking of uh, so many things about uh, that individual. Now, let us first start with uh, so many things about DNA. The first one is that if you are talking about, okay, as a molecular biologist, as a molecular biologist, one thing that is very, very important for you to learn by heart is the central dogma theory. Uh, the dogma theory. Now, if you just want to remember, if you want to remember the central dogma theory, just remember this mnemonic that is DNA makes RNA. Okay? Comma, and the RNA makes protein. And don't forget that from this one is a transcription. This is a translation. So once you are able to learn that DNA to RNA and RNA to protein, that one will give you the idea about uh, the central dogma theory, which has to do with uh, uh, what we have on the board. Now, the next thing to know and to learn is uh, how can we remember? How can we remember the so that is number two, the DNA and the composition or the components, composition DNA. Or the composition of your DNA. Let's say you do not even know anything about the composition. You have not come across it at any point in time. What you should know is that just know that uh, you know this, that is silly, okay? Just know that uh, silly people make silly people big. Okay? Once you are able to remember silly people big, you will remember that this silly is standing for sugar and these uh, people is standing for phosphates. And this big is standing for the basis. That is telling you that if anybody asks you, you will know. Uh, just remember, silly people big. That is sugar phosphate basis. Okay, these are the components of uh, DNA. Then the third thing that we want you to know that you should know is just um, base pairing, base pairing rule. Base pairing rule. So just remember when you remember this anti T. So that is telling you that A will pair with T. Huh? A will pair with T. And then when you remember good cake good cake that is telling you that g we simply pair with c g we simply pair with a c so that is that about entity and a good cake entity and good cake okay so the first one i we will talk about central dogma theory which is a dna makes rna and RNA make protein very easy to understand. Then about the composition of DNA, just remember silly people bake. That is sugar phosphate basis. So then base pairing rule, just remember anti T, that is A with T, and the good cake, that is uh, 
G will pair with uh, C. This is uh, what is called the base pairing rule. And some of the ways that you can remember at least three things about DNA. We are going to move as far as uh, what are the, how can you, for example, uh, uh, metabolic pathways. We will also go into that. Cellular, uh, cellular pathways like uh, glycolysis, Krebs cycles, uh, all these. We are going to go into the details of all this. And how can you really remember all this by the time we uh, get into this one? So that is uh, number three. Number three. So we are going to go to number four now. Number four. What do we actually mean? By when we want to look at um when we want to look at uh, things about the genetic code, there are so many things that I want you to know about genetic code. Number one, you should know that there are sixty four different combination of triplet codes that make uh that there are sixty four in number. Out of these fifty four, sixty four, one is code and three. Are the stop codons so three are the stop codon one is a start so how do you know the first one which is a aug which is a called the uh, start codon how will you know that okay the first thing you need to know and what you need to learn about the stop the stop codon is that uh, just remember remember Anti used anti uses uses glass. Okay, once you remember anti use uses glass, that will tell you that uh, that is the stop codon, and it's actually coding for methylene. It's actually coding for methylene AUG. That is that about uh, the so the three stop codon now. The three three stop codon. They are A. They are what? All of them start with U. All the three. You should know that all the three will start with what? We start with U. So. Mm -hmm. So the first one is U, this U, okay, let's do it this way, U, write it in a very big way like this, U, and uh, the fourth one is that you say A, yeah, okay, you are annoying. annoying, that means A, A, sorry, U, A, A. You are annoying. Then the second one is uh, Alice. Uh, Alice is good. So what you actually need here is uh, A and G. That is tell you don't need is. So just put it A U A G. Okay, U A G. Then the last one. The last one is just go away. Go away. That is U G A. That is standing for U G A. That is how to learn the stop codon as well as the, the start codon. The start uh, codon. Okay. Don't forget what I've said so far. Don't forget what I've said so far. Um, I started with okay. I started with uh, knowing what a cell is. What are the basic parts of a cell? Okay, that uh, the cell can be divided into two. You have the cytoplasm, which has to do with the liquid content 
of the cell. Cyto means cell. And that is synonymous to the blood. Every organism, the liquid that is flowing in all organism, sorry, especially in human, in man, is called the blood. So the blood of that cell is regarded as the cytoplasm. And the block, the blood of the nucleus is also regarded as the nucleus, nucleoplasm. So where the nucleoplasm, that is where the DNA is the sites, is the bed at which in or in which DNA will actually reside. And that's why we are interested in that. And the first thing that means we want to know anything in molecular biology. We want to know anything in molecular biology. These are the things that you actually need. Not only molecular biology, anything that has to do with bio biology, biological sciences. Whether you are a microbiologist, you need DNA. You understand some element of it. Then the four central dogma theory, and that central dogma theory, uh, DNA make RNA, and RNA make uh, protein. So having said that, you look at uh, the composition of dna so what do we have in dna or what make we make up what amino acids so out of these three out of these four codes one is universally recognized as the start codon and the other three are also universally recognized as the stop codon and i said how will you know uh, what's code for stats and what's actually code for uh, stop? What code for start codon is AUG? So just remember anti uses glass. That is AUG. That is the stop by start codon. And the other one, the other three, which has to do with uh, the three stop, the three stop codons. Okay. These are U is going to be big. That is the first one is that U is very common in all the three. You are annoying. You are annoying. And Al that is UAA. Alice is good. That is UAG. 